Hello everyone, I'm BVG Hill and welcome back once again to another episode of Mass Effect 2. Now last time we rescued Tally, she's now on the ship, but at the very very end of last episode, right before I did the outro, Kelly Chambers made it clear that Grunt wishes to speak to us, which means that he probably has a request for us. So we are going to do that. Hello Grunt, how are things going with you? Chamber said you were tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong, tense. I just want to kill something. Well, With that's my hands. More bad. so than usual. Like it's not my choice. Like I just want to. I don't know. Hey, now. That's expensive. See? Why do that? What's wrong? You have no idea. Okir didn't imprint anything to help you figure this out? I see pictures of old battles, voices of warlords, but this is a blood haze in my head. I want That's not exactly a good thing. Moving, fighting, I focus, but here my blood screams, my plates itch. Not in the hold of a you pressurized ship. I'm tank born. What is this? Let's ask the ship AI. Anything in your files about Krogan diseases that could cause this? Cerberus has a number of autopsies on file, but nothing on a living Krogan of this age and situation. Krogan are reluctant to share medical records. My people were defeated by doctors and labs. They will never let stuff like that leave the home world to Chunka. Then, looks like we need to go there then, right? Joker can get us to the Krogan home world. I need everyone at their best. Thank you, Shepard. I don't like this. Fury is my choice, not a sickness. All right, keep it real, Grunt. Uh, speaking of special missions to get everyone to their best, I think we have everyone's except for Garrus or Tally and Garrus's. I think, right? Yeah, because oh, and Thane. We don't have Thanes. But yeah, we have Jax. We have Grunts. We have Zaids. We have Mirandas. We don't have Samaras. Th we don't have Thanes. We have Morden and Jacobs. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do, we go back to the CIC, and we are going to let's see, maybe go back to Ilium, because we still have more missions on Ilium than anywhere else. We have these three main ones here. We're hacking systems for Liara, the Lair of the Shadow Broker starts there, and we have the one for Miranda. I think we're going to do the one for Miranda first. So, and we, I think we should... Wait, no, 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 we're not still in the system with Ilium, duh, because we went to uh, Haystrom last episode. So let's get on this shit. Alright, get us to Ilium. Actually, you know what? I'm going to scan a few of these planets here real quick. Oh, right. Goodness. We're back, finally, here. Uh, I scanned all the planets in this system and got a shitload of everything here. Let's land down on the surface here. The only problem with me doing stuff like that in the middle of an episode is it kind of makes it difficult for me to gauge how much actual usable footage I have. I think that was about like five or six minutes I spent doing that. I think. Uh, we need to take Miranda with us, so let's add her. Excuse me, my sources oh, hello. You were in a warehouse recently. Yep. Did you by any chance forward a questionable shipping note to Mr. Fax? I did. It looks suspicious, so I passed it on. I'm a representative for Mr. Fax. He's very grateful to you. Please accept this as a gift for bringing the shipping irregularities to his attention. Need me to find the shipper? Finding the person who cheated Thax? Thank you, but that won't be necessary. Mr. Thax will be making a series of polite calls. Hopefully a confrontation will not be required. Yeah, whatever. Happy to help. Pleasure. Have a pleasant day. That was the most polite Krogan I have ever seen. Thank you, Edie. All right, let's go check out Lantea at Eternity then, shall we? But before we do that, I need 
to... Oh, hello. Let's talk to Miranda. I need to see if my fish EV is here. Ilium is a cultural marvel. It is. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. Indeed. No, you don't understand. I lost it somewhere near the transport terminal. Pardon me, I'm on a call. Somewhere near the transport terminal. Huh. Very few quarians ever set foot here. Ilium doesn't allow the flotilla to approach beyond a certain distance. This is the greatest planet in the galaxy for those who can afford it. And they work hard to keep the quarian fleet away. Oh, that's kind of a dick move, isn't it? Kind of a dick move. Saris Technology, do you have a, a fishy VI? No? No fishy VI for me? I need fishy VI. Fishy VI. Let me in. Let me in. Wow, you're just telling that them that now? I've been gone for like weeks, I assume. You're just now telling your family you got the data back. All right, let's go to Eternity and let's talk to Lantea then. I want something that says, uh, oh, uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Hmm. Yeah, what a club. Am I right? Let's party. <laughs> yeah. Woo! So then he says, Oh, it's okay. Our amino acids are all different. So it's not like we can get diseases or anything. Alright, Lantea. Ms. Lawson, I'm glad you've made it. We've had a complication. What happened? You sound awfully He's similar to Miranda, that. actually. She's fine, but... You listed a man named Niket as your trusted source. He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Oriana's family to the terminal instead. Who is Niket? He didn't mention anything about Niket. He's a friend. He and I go back a, a long way. Do you want to bring in any of your other Ilium contacts, Ms. Lawson? No. You and Niket are the only two I trust on this. Tell me about the mercs. What information do you have about the mercenaries? I've confirmed that they're Eclipse and that they're working for an organization Ms. Lawson warned us about. Right. We could try to alert the authorities, but so far they've done nothing illegal. You made the right decision. We'll handle this ourselves. All right, what should we do? It's your sister, Miranda. What do you want to do? Lantea, we'll follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary, just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. Will Niket be safe? I doubt Eclipse will send all their people just to stop you. Do you want to give Niket any backup? Niket can take care of himself. Besides, any armed backup just draws attention to him. Alright, let's go. Whenever you are, Miranda. Thank you, Shepard. I appreciate it. Let's this. get a move on, then. I hadn't planned on Eclipse. But they never planned on you. Damn straight they didn't. That's the number one mistake that all baddies in the galaxy make. They don't plan on Commander Shepard showing up to the party. To wreck their shite. And she always does. We're gonna keep the same crew. Tally and Miranda. Could be good for Tally, really. Damn it! Eclipse mercenary gunships. They'll be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Well, they're blasting right past us. They don't give two shits. That ship just flew through uh, some supports. All right. What do we Let's got? Down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to take us alive. <sighs> I'm gonna assume no. I said, hold fire, damn it! I got this. They do. Okay. Since you're not firing yet, I trust you know who I am. 
Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. Right. Kidnapped? This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. Think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. He won't be helping you. Oh, uh, you right. Niket won't be helping us. Nothing you need to worry about. Nobody's gonna get killed unless you do something stupid. You walk away now, the girl goes back to her father, and everybody's happy. Right. Everybody but my sister. And me. Should we be talking to Captain Inyala about this? You don't want to talk to the captain. She's not as polite as I am. She's the best commando I've ever seen. I've seen her tear people in half with her biotics. And she's getting paid a lot to stop you. She gets in my way, she'll never have a chance to right. spend it. Wait, Brian, you said she was your twin sister. That what she told you? No, this crazy bitch kidnapped our boss's baby daughter. He's been looking for her for more than a decade. It's complicated, Shepard. We share the same DNA, just not the same birthday. Right. You took a baby from the richest guy in the galaxy, lady. I don't know what your damage is, but you're not getting away with it. I'm with Miranda. You're not getting Miranda's sister. If you push this, it'll go badly for you. Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. Oh, yeah? When I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want. <laughs> we don't make deals with mercs. Plus, that renegade option is super effective. The Solarian's like, oh Jesus! <laughs> he didn't even know what was going on. Poor guy. Almost feel bad for them. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked, bitches. Go, 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 go. All right. Very nice. Take a seat. Have a relax. Wow, my aim was atrocious right there. Come on. Wow, what is happening to my aim? It's going to shit, lads. Oh, hello, dead merc. You had a thingy thitmajigger in your hands. Ah, it's a comm unit. Hang on, I've got one of their radios. I'll patch us in, see if I can get an idea of what we're up against. Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. But my father grew her when I was a teenager. Like a tree. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my father do to her what he did to me. So I rescued her. She's almost a woman now. You never gave her age. Why didn't you tell me that we were saving a kid? She's not a child. She'll be 19 this year. But, well, it didn't seem relevant at the time, I suppose. There are people who'd use her against me. I'm very protective when it comes to Oriana. I'm sorry I didn't trust you sooner. You deserved to know. All right. I'm just going to trust her and say we need to get your Eclipse sister. If knows where Oriana is, they'll be moving in on her soon. We need to hurry. Agreed. I'm a bit worried by what the Merc said. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to the specs I reviewed, we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. All right. Can you tell me anything about the cargo processing yard? We'll be moving through conveyor systems. There'll be a lot of movement. Finding targets won't be easy. We'll need to stay sharp. Fair. These cargo transports carry hazardous materials. So watch what you shoot at. I hope your friend can be trusted. Absolutely. Niket is one of my oldest friends. I guess you could say he was my only real friend. He's the only person I didn't cut ties with when I left my father. Is there a chance your father could be using Niket to get to you? I'm sure he's tried, but Niket's one of the few people who understands what my father is really like. Right. I trusted him with my okay. life when I ran from my father, Shepard. He won't betray me now. All right, let's, let's go. Let's go find Niket and Oriana. Right. Oh. 
Oh shit. Cleaning my glasses. Hold on. Alright, let's take a shortcut through They're here. On the far side of the conveyor line. Find your shots. Okay, just give me a second to hack this PDA. In the middle of combat. Don't worry about me. Go ahead. Shoot some people up. It'll be fun. Alright, done deal. Move up. Um. Whoa. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. First death of the game. Oh, Well, it was just a few minutes ago. I assume that means when I walked into this area. That's kind of a pain in the ass, isn't it? It was a stupid death. I didn't pay attention to the drone. It broke me from cover and then I got wrecked by everyone. That was a stupid, stupid, stupid mistake. I apologize for that, everyone. Alright, this time we're gonna hang back quite a bit more, I think. Yeah, this is gonna work out a lot better. That's not my dream. Well, we killed it. There we go. All right, let's get him. Fry him, bitch. Fry him. Fry him good. All right. Right. Hope you really trust Nakat as much as you say, Miranda. I trust you, but I don't know. At the same time, let's scan this. this. Come in handy. Sub machine gun. Oh, hello. Double overload. Wreck him from afar. Blast off a couple arms and shit. Right. Open the locker. What do we got? 1,500 credits? Who keeps their money in a locker in the middle of freaking nowhere? It makes a whole lot of sense. There's some excellent cover here. Burn to death, bitch. Don't know where Tally is. Send out the drones. My shields are down. All right, we got this. All right, move up. Wow, that is a shot. Boom headshot. We got casualties. We got casualties. OMG, guys. Where's the rest of them? Nice. 
this might be useful. This can't be it. Or is it? Is this it? Give me my good gun back. Anything in here? Uh, secure terminal. I'll take me some of that, yeah. Oh, shit. That was stupid. Well, so much for that. <laughs> I just kind of hit right into a... Watch out. Ooh, blocker. Alright. him in the kneecap. I used to be an Eclipse Merc like you, but then I took 17 accelerated bullets to the knee. Um, help. God, my aim is off a little bit today. Goodness. All right. Hack the PDA. That one. All right, we did it. We did it, guys. We did it. All right. I'm going to search this other container here, and then I think we're pretty much all out of time for today, actually. Um, yeah. Let's access this secure terminal here. All right, I think that's all we have time for today. Like I just said, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I'm not sure how long this episode's going to be because I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to cut. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed it, like I said. And if you did, make sure to hit that like button down below. If you really enjoyed it, make sure to hit the subscribe button that's also down below for more content from me. And feel free to leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought, what you liked, what you didn't like, and any suggestions for games that you would like to see me play in the future. And last, but most certainly not least, if this video just blew your mind, then most definitely be sure to share this video with your friends, your family, your loved ones, random people you meet on the street, or the internet, whatever floats your boat. And I will see all of you in the next one. See you later.